we have accomplished so much this past season, and we've done a lot of great things and and broke a lot of records. So yeah, um, you know they really have to be the ones that they need to watch out for us, for you. especially next season. You I feel mean, that strongly about oh, it? Oh, of course, of course. I mean, even in the press, they were talking about they had, you know, very little answers to respond to what we were doing. How hard is it not to fight the urge to say, you know? I'm 6'10", 6'11", I got an up and under move, I got post moves, maybe we should run some plays for me. Uh, me and uh, Coach, Coach Carl, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> we've had this discussion several Have times. Mm -hmm. Yes, and uh, he basically said, um, you know, with the, with the situation now, next season he's going to have to run some plays for me. Yeah. Um, you which is you a believe great him? thing. Yeah, yeah, I believe him. Yeah. Anderson has overcome a difficult upbringing. He was bounced from parent to parent in Texas until his father finally gave him and his sister a choice, military school or a children's home. Hard work, but you wonder at any point, what's going on here? I'm getting bandied about all over the place. And, you know, where are my parents? What's going on? Not at all. I never really had never. that mindset of, like, why is this happening to me? Yeah. Um, why am I being treated this way? It was more like... Okay, I've got this situation. I'm going to take it as a challenge. I'm going to try to make the best out of it and basically raise myself, really. Yeah. You overcame that. I mean, mm -hmm. what, what, how did you overcome all that? Just staying positive. Just staying I mean, positive. If you just, you know, think and set high goals and dream big, I mean, because... That was it. Yeah. Did you use you those same views and same thought when you couldn't play for two years in the NBA when your livelihood was taken mm -hmm. away because of, of the drug thing did you use that same thing during that time you sat out well of course I mean I, I only did it to myself and um, I took the punishment and all I could do is um, not think negative about the whole situation of how I got there but how, how I'm gonna get, get out how I'm gonna get out how I'm gonna get out and how I'm gonna get back to that spot where I was at or if not even better